Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're doing a Christmas shop with me of all the places and today we're going to be starting out with Walmart. I was pleasantly surprised with Walmart's selections. This was one of my most favorite signs that I found out of all of the stores I went to and they had lots of Ray Dunn looking ornaments and just so many cute affordable things. I did grab a few things from here and some of the other places places and I'll be doing a haul as well as a plan with me on Wednesday next week I will be doing a Christmas plan with me and my haul of all of the stores I loved these little signs for four dollars and 88 cents from Walmart and I did grab a couple of them because they were so cute they're like the scroll type signs and there were some really cute buckets and cheap decorative picks I think that Walmart had the cheapest picks out of all of the stores that I went to for 98 cents you cannot go wrong and these clip-in ornaments for a dollar 48 were so cute I think that this like jute twine adds just a little bit of texture to the tree and gives it some warmth as well especially if you have a flock tree like I do I found this Merry Christmas black Christmas sign and that was about $15 and they had the cutest wrapping stuff. I am obsessed with the black paper, like wrapping paper this year, that like almost like the brown craft paper, but it's black. But Walmart definitely had some affordable um, pieces and these $33 mini trees that you could stick outside on the front porch and they had a cute little basket bottom. For $33, you cannot go wrong. And of course their garland is the cheapest and was the nicest quality. I like blown away with how nice a quality Walmart's Christmas items were this year. And a bunch of the lamb's ear wreaths, and I'm more so going for the cedar natural look this year um, with my flocked Christmas tree. And I do have lots of like dried florals, so lots of like natural colors going into this year's scheme. But I will get more into that later and how I incorporate a new scheme without spending too much money on all new decor. I like to incorporate what I currently have and just add some like new colors and pieces to make it a new theme. The second store that I went to was TJ Maxx and I felt like they had so many good finds. Oh my goodness. I found so many Ray Dunn items. I was blown away. If you guys are local to the Fargo-Moorhead area where I'm from, get over to TJ Maxx in Fargo for your Ray Dunn Christmas stuff. They had cookie jars and they had cups and they had these cute little gift sets and pillows. So many Ray Dunn items. So if you are a Ray Dunn hunter, definitely head over to TJ Maxx as soon as possible. I know it's early for Christmas decor, it's not even Halloween yet, but I like to get to the stores before the mass chaos hits because they do run out of stock really quick and the sales are really good right before um, like Halloween ends on Christmas stuff. But I was really loving the um, like blush and this black. Do you see that black velvet tree? Oh my goodness. I almost grabbed it, but I didn't. I might have to go back and grab it. It's like a black, but almost a navy. I don't know, but that velvet is just so rich and beautiful. But TJ Maxx definitely had some of my most favorite unique finds were from TJ Maxx and so affordable as well. TJ Maxx is always super affordable, which I love. But yes, lots of really cute Christmas stuff over at TJ Maxx this year. Also wanted to add that TJ Maxx is one of my favorite spots besides Bath and Body Works to grab candles because they're so affordable and you can get them in every color under the rainbow and they're so cute. You can get like big ones, little ones from like $3.99 all the way up to $9.99. Like I said, just super affordable and they all smell so good. My favorite are the warmer scents or something with a, like, I love leaves in the fall, but I love sweater weather and I love winter from Bath and Body Works in the winter time. So so I'm trying to find similar scents this year from other stores just because I like the different um, like colored and shaped candles but anyways heading into our next store I went to Hobby Lobby next which is where I went the most 
ham guys I found so many good finds their floral selection I went when it was 50% off when this video goes live uh, floral is still 50% off today so make sure you get your butts over to Hobby Lobby and pick up some of these items because all Christmas is 50% off and florals are 50% off through today now if you catch this on an off week where florals aren't 50% off just remember that they have rotating weeks so if it's not on sale this week it will be on sale next week some of my favorites in the Christmas shop section at Hobby Lobby were the the chunky knitted stockings and the tree skirts I do have a knitted cream tree skirt that I will be using this year I was going to do a basket but I wanted to keep it a little bit more cozy like with a warmer cozy texture oh and also Riker spilled his entire thing of almond milk while I was shopping real mom life I had to include that because it was just ridiculous but anyway a lot of good finds here at Hobby Lobby this year I can't wait to reveal what I found and what my color scheme is for the year it is so so good but I hope you guys enjoy the rest of this Hobby Lobby footage you have a peek at some of the things that maybe you're looking for this year you can kind of see the things that I'm gravitating towards so you can get some sneak peeks as to what I'm going to be doing this year but like I said just enjoy the rest of this Hobby Lobby footage and I will hop back in when we get over to Target for a good time smile my dear come on in come on up come on over we'll be dancing round the tree so let us have a swinging Christmas Just like one, two, three Target I found first off this maroon plaid rug it's for layering and I love to layer my rugs out on the front porch and I this color is amazing for fall and for Christmas I think it's going to be such a good addition to the front porch I did not grab it today but I do plan on grabbing it I had a budget set out for myself and I stuck to it which like I said when I'm looking for new items to add to my Christmas decor I always put out a budget for myself because I like to utilize what I already have but I did find some really cute vases and some yummy candles at Target from like five to ten dollars and of course the magnolia section had some beautiful pieces I loved their rugs and I like their tapered candles I think tapered candles are so classy and I love their lanterns everything in the hearth and home 
section this year for Christmas is just spot on. Speaking of spot on, the value section at Target, the, the bullseye dollar spot had, had cute little Christmas trees and houses and lots of really good stuff. I highly recommend that you guys get over to the value spot before they sell out because they do sell out quickly. All right, you guys, that is going to wrap it up for this Christmas shop with me. Now stay tuned because Sunday I have a get it all done with me where I organize out my Christmas bins and then on Wednesday I will be sharing my haul as well as my Christmas plan and theme for this year. I can't wait to share it all with you guys. All right, I will see you tomorrow for my get it all done with me. Okay, bye guys.